He's got the ball. He's coming in for the win. He kicks it. Goal! Hey everybody, I'm Nathan Crane. I'm Derek Crane. And this is Fitness Friday. So we know what happens a lot of times when you've got these big goals, these big dreams, these big resolutions. Um, you write it down, you do the, the typical goal setting process, but then you never achieve those goals. You never get to experience the results. And if you want to know why that happens, we're here to share with you today why that happens as well as what you can do to actually achieve your goals. And there is a process, there is a formula, it's proven, and there's so many people, including ourselves, that have experienced this formula over and over again. Um, and so we wanna share it with you. First off, you know, we wanna talk about just the goal setting process, right? Yeah. Correct. So right, right away, it is potent and powerful to have your overall goal. And if it's if it's a big dream, dream as big as you want with it. If you want to run a marathon, if you want to increase your strength to this capacity, where like you're you're benching 250 pounds, don't put don't put any limits on any of that. If you're wanting to, or even if you're just wanting to hike without pain, or or whatever your goals are, definitely have the overall. Goal. and then and then start start breaking it down into monthly what would that what would it take to get to that monthly and then even break that down what would that take to get to weekly does that take two or three times a week does that take five times a week of exercising and going to the gym and then now break it down on a daily basis every single morning write down write down a goal for your own health and fitness what you're gonna do that day to achieve this big goal but focus on that day and then achieve that goal even put even put a, a box next to it where after it's done at the end of the end of the day you put a check next to that and you're one step closer and so this is true for every part of your life uh, whether it's your yeah. fitness whether it's weight loss like Derek said yeah you bench 250 maybe you want to bench 450 yeah. you know whether it's your finances your relationships whatever that might be whatever your overall fitness goal, health goal, just personal goals are, you know, this is such valuable, um, such valuable things that you can do. And as Derek said, know the big goal, but then start having goals that help you achieve that along the way. You might not know the how to yet, and that's fine. Just have the goals, list them out, and, and know that you're working towards it this year but it could take you longer. It could be shorter, it could be longer. You know, huge goals often take years and years to achieve, right? The, the top boxers in the world, the, the top athletes in the world, you know, they, may, maybe they had a dream to be an NBA uh, all-star when they were 12 years old. How long did it take them to get there? Maybe another 10 years, 15 years, right? So big goals are gonna take more time. Just know that, yeah. but have that goal and work towards it every day. The other part of it is the how-to, and the biggest thing that you can do is to act as if you've already achieved it. And this is just a law of manifestation, and it's true for every area of your life. You know, Conor McGregor, the, the lightweight boxing champion, one of the things that he talked about was when he went into the ring, even early on, he knew he was the winner. Yeah. He acted like he was the champion before anybody knew him. He already felt it in himself. How do you have such certainty about achieving something? You have to believe it. Mm -hmm. You know, if you want to lose 100 pounds, you can't focus on losing 100 pounds. You'll never lose it, yeah. right? So say you're 300 pounds and you want to be 200. You don't focus on losing 100 pounds. You focus on what would I feel like if I was 200 pounds? What would I act like? Where would I go? How would I dress? Look, look in the mirror and how would I feel about myself? You have to practice that every day and act as if you've already achieved it because then what you do is you start stimulating your mind, you start pulling in solutions, you start 
feeling the feelings, you start activating those emotions that you would feel like if you were that millionaire, if you were that civil servant to humanity, if you were that you know, 200 pound person instead of 300 pound or that champion all-star, you know, that's how you have to be. You have to create such certainty within your mind that you're already experiencing that thing which you desire, then you create the environment and atmosphere for that goal to become a reality. That is so potent and so true. Yeah. And that brings it that brings it forward into manifestation. Moment by moment manifestation of what you're truly wanting to experience. Yeah, and then that's where you have to just be persistent. You just have to believe. You have to trust and you have to keep taking action every day. That's where Derek, what he said about having goals every day, it's like, okay, so feel like, all right, I feel great about, I'm the champion or I'm the, you know, I'm, I'm just being of great service to humanity or I'm just being a good father or I'm that 200 pounds now. And then set goals. All right, I have to get to the gym today. Mm -hmm. I have to wake up at 6.30 instead of 7.30 to start my day earlier and start meditating. Mm -hmm. I have to read a new book every, every uh, two weeks. So today I'm going to read you know, 10 pages. I'm going to read 10 pages this morning. and Focus on that day by day. Feel it. Act as if you've already achieved it and your goals will become a reality. Don't dream about it in the future as something you might get one day. Act like you have it now and live your life in that energy and watch what happens. So thanks so much for tuning in today. Let us know your thoughts, comments, questions below. Uh, if, if you're not subscribed already, make sure to hit that subscribe button for future videos and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you guys. See you in the next video. Take care.